I went to this like jam night at a bar that I had played at the night before. No one was there the night that I played. Mm -hmm. And this local that was sitting there was like, people should hear you play. Come here tomorrow night with your guitar. This place will be filled with musicians and people that would love to hear your music. Yeah. So I did and I went and I played a song. And after I played, this guy came up to me. I went to the bar and I was just sitting there. This guy came up to me and goes, I really like your music. And <laughs> I like it because of like, it named like three really specific things mm -hmm. that he liked about it. And I was like, okay. I, I remember, I was like, I'm listening. Like, what's your point, you know? Mm -hmm. And he's like, I want to record it. Let's do it before you leave. Because I had like four more days in Berlin. Mm -hmm. So I spent my last day in Berlin writing this song mm -hmm. with this guy. And like finishing it and recording it. It's the version, the, what we recorded is on my EP. Mm -hmm. And so now when I play it, like I always think of him and how just sort of like cosmic that day was. Yeah. That like... I mean, you know, you could always say, like, he could have been a crazy person. But he could have been just, like, out for money, out for, you know, just taking my music to sample it somewhere else or something. But, no, nah, he was just, like, a really talented, awesome yeah, guy that, like, I still stay in touch with him. We're talking about, like, making a CD together at some point. That's like, awesome. And it's just crazy. Like, I play it and I think of, like, all the other places I've played it now. The trigger of music. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was so. It was just the, like one of the best days too. Like just sitting in this guy's studio, like mm -hmm. in Berlin, like, writing a song together. It was cool. We spent 